स्टूडेंट स्टार्टिंग विद नेक्स्ट लेसन लेसन नंबर टू इम्प्लीमेंटिंग द सिंगल्टन पैटर्न इन दिस लेसन वी विल स्टडी अबाउट हाउ वी कैन इम्प्लीमेंट द फैक्ट्री मैथड्स द फैक्ट्री मैथड आर द स्पेशल काइंड ऑफ मैथड्स दैट अलाउ यू टू क्रिएट द इंस्टांस ऑफ ए क्लास विद इन क्लास इट सेल्फ सेकेंड वी विल इम्प्लीमेंट द सिंगल्टन पैटर्न नाउ कम टू द फर्स्ट टॉपिक एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए क्लास विद फैक्ट्री मैथड्स In this example, the class LCL airplane keep a reference of all the instances in a static attribute. The instance state is permitted within the class itself. That means you can create the objects within the class, within the same class. As you can see, this is a class LCL underscore plane, and this is the method of the same class. We are creating the uh, instance uh, sorry we are creating here the object of the same class within the method itself and can only be done using the static method factory when the method is called it firstly check if an identical instance is already exist or not if it does then it return the existing instance instead of creating the new one so you can see first of all we are going to define the static method how we can define the static method with the help of class methods then we are using a special kind of method which is a factory method then importing and then returning value ro underscore plane in this method factory first of all we are going to read the table gt underscore instance into ro underscore plane if the instance that uh, the particular instance that we are going to read if it is found there then it will return the particular instance value ro underscore plane if it is not there that means if sy subrc is not equal to 0 that means it is not existence in this internal table then it will create the object ro underscore plane and then we can append r underscore plane into the gt underscore instance so when the method is called factory method is called it first check it is checking here if an identical instance already exist in this table if it doesn't then it create the object and store into this table if it does then it return the it will return the existing instance instead of creating the one so this was the use of the factory method now come to the next topic singleton class using a factory method generally singleton class is a special kind of a class or special case of the factory concept where in the class stores only the one instance if you want to restrict a class to create number of instead of creating the number of instances we are restricting it to only store only the one instance singleton that means singleton only one instance the class is instantiated on the first call of the factory method get underscore instance for all the future class calls only the reference of the existing object is written you can see in this factory method class methods get underscore instance we are again returning r underscore instance if it is already there in this method if go underscore instance is bound then it will return go underscore instance equal to r underscore instance that means if it is already there in the list it will return the same object else it will create the object and then assign to the go underscore instance now come to the next topic singleton class using the static constructor as shown in the slide lcl singleton this is the lcl singleton class makes the use of the static constructor and how we can create the static constructor with the help of class constructor to create an instance the get underscore instance method no longer create an instance but only return the reference of an already existing one this slide 
and in this slide there is a little one difference here we were using the normal method static method get underscore instance here we are using static constructor everything else everything is same so this was all about the lesson number two of the unit number eight